here at the shrimp yard at the Brownsville Ship Channel. Shrimpers say they're still behind on hundreds of workers this season. The shrimping industry is known to be a tough one. New shrimpers quit within days and asked to go home. Captain Jesus Moreno says the longest trip to bring a worker back home was de Luciana. <laughs> a two day trip from the other side of the Gulf. Luciana, de Luciana. A cost in both time and fuel. Captain Moreno has been in the shrimping business for 33 years. Es duro que que estar de la it's a tough job, he says, because you have to be away from your family. This year, the number of visas issued under the H-2B program expanded. Captain Moreno wanted to hire experienced crews under the program from Mexico or Latin America, but that didn't happen. He says he hired an American. I brought him back, he says, because the worker didn't want to be on the ship after 20 days. The H-2B visa program includes people who want to work in hotels, restaurants, landscaping, and other sectors. Andrea Hans, who represents the Texas Shrimpers Association, says shrimping is just a tiny portion of the H-2B visa pool. She says this year there were just too many applicants and not enough visas. About 15, 20 percent of these guys down here actually received uh, a visa worker. Hans says Texas Shrimpers as a whole need a total of 750 workers. You're thinking that's such a small number and that's all we need uh, to keep this industry going. We're a million dollar, uh, close to a billion dollar industry. As a matter of fact, we estimate that we're losing close to a million dollars a day by not having a, an adequate workforce. Shrimpers like Moreno are still standing by their boats, waiting for the next catch, even if he's shorthanded, hoping this problem doesn't keep up. Who knows, he says. He hopes the issue can get resolved somehow and he hopes he can get experienced temporary workers on board. The Texas Shrimp Association says they're pushing for a change to take effect for next year's shrimping season. At the Brownsville Ship Channel, Christian Mount Pricing, Channel 5 News.